Hey guys, what's going on? This is Levi Pell. Please like and subscribe. All right. So today we're gonna be focusing on something that um, I see a lot of YouTubers are doing, and those who want to also do the same as far as like uh, be able to have that software. Um, oh, pardon me, not software. Uh, I meant to say embroidery machine. Now having an embroidery machine gives you a lot of advantage and the advantage of it is basically being able to do a lot I like a lot more um, you can do hats you can do like um, logos for companies and also you can um, do a lot of stuff for kids but let's get started um, so basically today we're going to look at different embroidery machines and how they can help you and which ones is cost effective for you alright we're not trying to use the word cheap over here we're trying to use the word cost effective alright so right off the bat we're looking at embroidery machines that's I mainly focus my stuff on Amazon because I like to concentrate where I get all my equipment um, and most of my uh, software along with items I like to maintain it in one location just in case uh, taxes wants to know what's going on I can just go to my Amazon account and just show them everything that they need to know all right it's easy pull files and whatnot uh, anyways and they also send you emails of whatever you purchase so you can have it for your own document uh, okay cool so here we have um, some embroidery machines these are like called multi needles right so one head multi needle machine right okay cool so we have here different prices I would not purchase an uh, embroidery machine for this price on Amazon by the way uh, if you're ordering a multi needle uh, unless you just don't want to deal with having to pay fees and stuff like that um, and being on a monthly uh, lease for, I mean monthly financing for these machines um, I'd go to like the actual companies of um, one I can name is um, Tajima, you have uh, Recoma, um, you have Babylock, um, Janome um, there's different embroidery companies out there and if you're buying something that's this expensive it's like if you're getting a brand new car uh, why try to get it so if I use at a, at a um, shop one of those like regular auto shops when you can just go straight to the dealership and get it and get all the bells and whistles and get the warranty that comes with it alright so um, if you if you want to do it, if not, I wouldn't recommend it. Um, as a matter of fact, the embroidery machine I do I plan on getting here on Amazon is not gonna be this, right? So um Alright, so I was looking at this um from Janome and this embroidery machine is a one head believe it's a four needle yeah one head four needle you can tell by the controls right here alright so um, oh it also says it jo Janome MB4S commercial four needle embroidery machine alright so um, this was my goal to, to get uh, off of Amazon um, again I may purchase from Amazon but I don't recommend anybody else I just store for a reason and I'm the type that I'll look at the machine and I will want to like know how to use it break this whole console apart break all this apart to figure out how to use it so in case I have issues I can you know fix it myself um, I'm just one of those people alright so it comes with the screen and everything uh, but I'm not trying to focus on uh, detail about the machines basically the reason why I'm doing this is just give you options 
Alright, so on Amazon, you want multi needle heads? They got multi needle heads. Fairly cheap, actually. And free shipping. Uh, and judging by this, uh, probably not gonna take too long to reach you. Because look at, look at this right here. You order it today, you'll get it between December 4th to December 9th. That's not that bad. That's pretty quick. Alright. Okay, cool. So, um, what I do plan on getting, and I would love to get, is this one right here. The brother. Alright, this one is the brother PE. 770 you have a uh, a large range over here um, you have uh, okay, yeah you have the embroidery um, hoop that's right here the embroidery hoops you have different sizes but I'm most mostly intrigued with this one right here the big one this is a five by seven embroidery hoop and this five by seven um, allows you to have uh, maybe not that much of a I'd say not that much of a um, length and width but it's big enough that it gives you enough um, f footprints or embroidery area that you can actually embroider a good detail amount on it alright on top of that you can remove you can do like an image all right let me get out of this you can do an image within the, the embroidery area right remove the embroidery um hoop push it down a little bit and you can continue embroidering so this doesn't really limit you it's all about how you use it pretty much all right and most of embroideries it Rarely you'll see like a full back embroidery, like a 11 by 17 or like a 13 by 19. Rarely you'll see that because not too many people want it because it's way too expensive. All right, so people tend to go for pocket and then small logos. So you you don't need that much. All right. Um. So as you can see, this one would be considered a one needle embroidery machine. All right. So that's. Uh, the reason why I also I would like that one is I also see uh, I believe it's um, a Dove Productions. He usually has this, and uh, he's usually doing like different type of embroideries on it. Uh, hopefully, it's the same one. If not, it's a five by seven that he has embroidery area. All right. So I'm hoping to maybe get this one, but this is more like an afterthought, you know. It's an afterthought. Uh, you know what? Let's see this video. How long is it? Oh, cool. So, on Amazon, apparently, they have a video. Are so. you a seller or embroiderer interested in taking your skills to the next level? Then why not check out the PE770 embroidery machine from Brother? This computerized machine, perfect for any embroidery enthusiast, is easy to learn easy to use, and a great choice whether you want to embroider delicate fabrics or more sturdy items like denim. Beyond the fact that the PE770 is made by Brother, a leader in embroidery technology, what makes the machine a must-have for your crafting room? Let's take a look at the top features that will help turn embroidery from your hobby to your passion. First, the PE770 has a large 5x7 embroidery area, which allows you to express your creative vision on larger items like tote bags. And you'll want to get expressive when you see the machine's assortment of 136 built-in embroidery designs, 10 built-in frame designs, and 6 built-in fonts. Not enough design? Then visit iBroidery.com, the Brother Embroidery Design website where designs can be purchased individually. There are thousands of designs to choose from, including Disney, Warner Brothers, and Lifestyle Designs, as well as a selection of alphabet designs. The PE770, which has computer connectivity, makes design import easy. Simply download designs from iBroidery.com or your computer to a USB stick and insert the stick in the conveniently located USB port. Another great feature of the PE770 is the large backlit LCD screen, which is easy to see and easy to use. Use the screen for design selection and editing. 
to view the helpful built-in tutorials, to set machine preferences, and more. With all of the features of the PE770, you'll probably want to use it all the time to make as many creations as possible. Luckily, the machine stitches at a speedy 650 stitches per minute, so you can complete more designs faster. Whether you're interested in making beautiful home decor items or recycling your clothing with new embellishments, the computerized PE770 is the machine for you. To learn more, visit brother-usa.com. Alright, that's enough of that. Um, so yeah, that was a cool video. Alright, so as you can see, like, there's multi-stuff, mul mul uh, not bad. Uh, there's multiple things that you can do with the embroidery machine. Um, but I'm not looking for this one because this one's pretty pricey. If you look down, it's... Oh, the price not even here. Uh, yeah, this... This is in the thousand. Like, I think it's at least a thousand something. If not 99 or whatever. It's expensive. I'm not going to purchase this. Um, so, yeah, as we're going along, like, uh, the machine I do want to purchase is right here. Oh, my gosh. This is what I want right there. Now, the embroidery uh, area is still the same as the um, PE770. I believe this one is made by hold on one second uh, Eversol alright so the Eversol, Eversol uh, Sparrow X um, is the one that I'm looking for now right now it's this price so come on right now it's this price uh, seven seven ninety nine. it's a pretty good price the reason why it's so low is because um, this machine is not as high tech as you think. Uh, it's got Wi-Fi, which is good, um, and it does have USB connection and computer com connection, but it's just bare bones, which is why it's so low in price. It's really bare bones. Like there's n there's no touch touch screen right here. Everything is by buttons. Like you'd have to press this button and that button. You can't touch the screen to like make it do anything. There's no like uh, 3.2 LCD pan, um, LCD screen, nothing like that. It's just it's bare bones. And I'm the type of guy I like bare bones. I like to start from the beginning because it helps me to get to know the machine and get in touch with it, you know. Um, and then when I do work my way up to getting something more. Uh, fabulous or more detail and with more gears um, I can appreciate the machine more so it's showing you this lady that's using her uh, whether it be iPad or any type of tablet you need a tablet or a computer in order to use this machine if you don't have one you're out of luck unless you got a USB and still you kind of out of luck because it's kind of hard to transfer information into it without you actually knowing what you're transferring. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so, if you're planning on getting this because of the price, just beware. Like, you need a computer and you need to be able to hook it up. Or you need an iPad, iPad or a, a tablet, something to help you along. Um, so, it's not that bad in price. Um, so, it's... cutting area is 4.75 by uh, 7 inches right um, I'm not really worried about that because the things I'll be doing in this is going to be too incredible um, I just need the machine to embroider that's all, all right? um, so yeah this is the machine that I really want to get you know uh, Definitely, this is going to be on my wish list. Um, so, yeah, the Everstone's Barrel X, and hopefully, you get to see me with it next, I'd say, around February. Hopefully, you get to see me with it. Um, moving on. Alright, so there's also another 
machine that does uh, I believe uh, this one I think it does yeah it's right here it does 7.9 by 7.9 so it's almost 8 inches by 8 inches alright um, it is an embroidery machine it, the, the field is a little bit wider now this one is a little bit more costly so I, I'm probably not going to go for this one but I just want you guys to see that this machine does exist and um, it's pretty it's not that bad in price alright Alright, so I actually have an embroidery machine, and my embroidery machine is, I think it's right here. It's pretty much this one right here. Let me move this here. There we go. Alright, cool. So the embroidery machine I have is this one right here. It's, I have the previous one, but it's the same, same thing, same style. So the one I have is the Brother PE um, 540D embroidery machine. Uh, my current embroidery area is the same thing. It's 4x4 four four, um, hooping area. Or hoop area. Um, I do have the LCD screen, but the difference between mine and this one, the new generation, is it's in black and white. Uh, so when I, I can't wait to upgrade to the new one that I want to get. Um, it's not for the screen, but for the hooping area and being able to see everything on the computer is going to be great also because I can just just prep it and then send it to machine um, with the Eversome. But yeah, so this is the basically the machine that I have. Um, if you do get this machine, uh, they're not that much. As a matter of fact, they're like oh snap looks like the price went up this used to be 300 so I guess they jacked it up um, a lot of people have been buying embroidery machines a lot of YouTubers have been talking about embroidery machines so uh, I guess the embroidery companies and uh, Amazon have been catching wind about it uh, but don't worry there's other ones alright um, so yeah what I wanted to get uh, I already got this uh, embroidery machine one similar uh, and my hoop and air is 4x4 four four. so uh, when I do my next videos what you're going to be seeing is um, me talking about these alright these bobbins so if you have an embroidery machine this would be a good time to get like some bobbins like price is really good right now um, there's like how many bobbins is in here uh, looks like there's 144 pieces. Damn, that's a whole lot. So you're not gonna run out. All right. Uh, each bobbin, depending on how how much you do, can be anywhere from like 10 to like anywhere from 20 uh, pieces of uh, embroidery that you could do with it. So if you're getting it for this price, 144, that's pretty good. That means you'll never run out of bobbins. And if you do run out, you can always get yourself white thread, preferably polyester, and just re-bobbin all of them, um, re-thread all the bobbins, you know? I like that word, bobbin. Re-bobbin. Alright, cool. So, on top of that, um, on top of getting bobbins, you might want to get yourself some, um, embroidery stabilizer you don't have to get the tear away but I like the tear away I usually double up the tear away and then tear it away um, hence what it's for um, basically a tear away is, bas is supposed to be used as a stabilizer and what it does is it stabilizes the the thread onto whatever fabric or yeah whatever fabric you stitch and it keeps everything together so it doesn't unwind the thread alright so it's a really good price $10 for uh, sorry 1088 for looks like a hundred pieces and it's 8 by 8 so 
so you have tons of room. Yeah. All right, cool. Okay, so next up, on top of getting um, bobbins and birdie th uh, stabilizer, you're going to want to get some of this right here. If you're using the one needle, one head um, and birdie machines, like the one I have, the PE, 540D. Uh, it's a good idea to try to get yourself some some of these threads. All right, on the bottom of them, they usually have numbers. So in case your embroidery machine says put on thread uh, Z15 or something like that, uh, whichever one says Z15 is the one that you're going to be using. All right. So I'll put all these links in the description below on this video. So that way you guys can get everything in case you're trying to make uh, your way towards the embroidery field. Uh, if you don't like heat transfers, you don't like vinyls, you prefer just doing embroidery, then definitely you can you can go for it. Uh, anybody who tries to get embroidery, if you have the money to spend and get a commercial embroidery machine, I'd say get it. So you can get the multi-needle one-head embroidery machine, but if you don't have much, if you can save fifty bucks for, let's say, fifty bucks for um, fifty bucks a week, would be about two hundred. So if you can save for two months, fifty bucks. Then you have 400 and you can easily get yourself um, an embroidery machine. Uh, let's go back real quick. Yeah, let's scroll down. Bear with me, guys. All right, cool. There we go. There we go. Nice. So you have the PE 535 you can get if you don't have that much money. Like I said, you save 50 bucks per week for two months. You automatically get 400 bucks. So you can easily buy this right here. All right. If you really want to get started in embroidery and you don't have, oh, there it is right here. Um, you don't have the thousand dollars to spend on a PE 800 or a PE 770. Just go and purchase one of these. I have the same one. I'm going to be doing a lot of videos on them. All right. Um, no, I don't have the same one. I have the one that's similar to this one, the PE 540D. Um, but yeah, it cost me pretty much this price. It was like around the 300s. I bought it a long time ago. Alright, so on top of that, get yourself some embroidery hoops, um, which probably come with the machines. You need some bobbins and some thread with some stabilizer, and you should be good. So this is the next thing I'm going to talk about. I'm going to do an unboxing soon. Um, this whole month, this my focus is going to be based on like embroidery and hats because I have a heat press uh, that can heat press hats also. So I have a lot of things coming up pretty soon, and also uh, an announcement I'm probably I'm going to make at the end of this video. So if you stay tuned, you you'll get to uh, hear the announcement. All right. Try not to skip because I don't know when I'm going to say it, but it's going to be towards the end. All right. So, um, what I did was I bought one of these right here. All right. So let me put it in perspective. Uh, what, in case you're new to the embroidery game, uh, what this is is this right here. All right. And what it does is it holds different types of bobbins. I mean, uh threads different size 
as you can see different types but the main focus of it is to use it so I can uh, oh there's a bad picture right here okay cool let's click on it okay alright so the main focus of this uh, I think it's called a thread stand. There we go. The main purpose of a thread stand is it holds the threads, and then the threads end up going in this thing right here, this little loop. Um, then it goes to, I believe, the stabilizer, and from there it goes into the embroidery machine that gets threaded in, and then you can do anything you want. Uh, the main focus of why I'm trying to get this because the embroidery machine itself has a thread. Um, that's already there with these will be four now I won't have to constantly have to like remove thread put them back this will already be hooped and ready to go so the minute the machine stops and wants the next color I can just add the uh, next color um, this is not really gonna make things really fast for me but it gives me the ability to have the capability of what the multi needles have which is being able to switch different colors and have them available ready to go all right so i grab one of those uh, thread stands and you'll be seeing it in a video pretty soon so as i start doing the embroidery all right so now lastly we're going to talk about hoops okay so You want to get yourself the biggest hoops that you can get, all right. So hopefully you get a hoop set that has a lot. If not, I plan on purchasing this soon. Um, just grab this. Uh, the reason why I'm talking about it is because on your embroidery machine, there's a button you can press, and it'll just it just moves the the embroidery hoops to the side, and then from there, if you press. Um, there's a button you press to see your area you push it to the side it'll give you a new area and you can continue embroidering so if you have a 4x4 four four area right and you're doing something that's 8x8x5 eight by, eight by all you have to do is just get yourself no you're doing something that's 7x6x5 by, by right? You get yourself one of these embroideries, embroidery hoops, and you can just keep shifting the artwork over and just keep embroidering. Alright? When you're done, uh, you'll probably have to push the clothing up a little bit so you can get the area that you need and you can keep doing the same thing. Alright? So, in case anybody wants to start embroidering or wants to get into the embroidery game uh, like I said these embroidery machines are really good I've had my embroidery machine for like I think three years now and just now I'm really starting to get into embroidery so it should be fun and hopefully you grab an embroidery machine and you can join me Yeah, this kind of concluded. Like I said, my goal hopefully is to go to a multi needle. Um, I'm probably gonna come over here and purchase mine again. If you are not sure, you might not want to purchase yours on Amazon because um, customs. If you're not willing to put in work into fixing the machine yourself embroidery machine yourself and just rely on the instructions on how to if you're not willing to do that then uh, you might not want to consider purchasing here because your customer service is going to be limited um, as opposed to you going to directly to a company where they give you more customer service all right okay cool so this is the end of the video please like and subscribe I appreciate it um, 
and hopefully on uh, next video you get to see me and brother and use my my PE machine so I can do some embroideries all right um, it's been cool oh the news yeah so I just gave no um basically I'm moving into a another room and the reason is because this room even though it can hold all my stuff um, I need an office that's closer to me and where I live so um, I have an at home I'm gonna have an at home office so just like I did before with the um, the business being in the basement I tried the shop thing and it is affordable but the distance I have to get to this place ends up um, making me stay like overnight and it kind of suck I don't want to stay overnight here I want to just finish my work do some YouTube videos make some samples and then after that just knocking out on my bed knocking out on my bed and over here doesn't really give me that it mostly gives me time to study on what the next video is going to be um, do some artwork do some stuff for customers and then before you know it I have to like waste more time so I can pass the time and frankly I live way too far to from this office and this place has been really great and what they do and what they've helped me with um, as far as being able to get my business off the ground uh, a little bit further and being at an office location now I'm not moving abruptly but I will be moving a lot of equipment and hopes to do the video um, at a different location so next time you see me I'll be at a different location now that doesn't mean to say that um, I will stop being here um, I have a couple months still so a lot of my stuff is going to be coming here because uh, apparently you got to prepay to to be here like you got to put in like, first last and security so it's a lot of money and they give you up to two months and within the two months they hold your money and then you know once everything is good then you know you get your security but I have like a whole like I think two months here you know and I'm gonna use it to the fullest I'm gonna have my stuff mailed to my business address and which is over here you know for the business that way I can keep like my home and business separate but while I get everything prepared and I move into the office in my new location this will have been a great experience because now when I'm talking to you guys I can let you know how it's like being in a shop and I can let you know how it's like having been in a basement and now having a room for this for the machines in my spot and, which is great this new spot I got it's really good so I get to give the business its own dedicated room which is pretty cool um, I grasped that concept from being here uh, we just taught me a lot uh, you always want to give your room, your business importance and I've been investing a lot of time here so I've been trying my best alright so I need to end the video soon because it's gonna be too much <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I'm already looking at 30 minutes. It's a lot. Please like and subscribe. This is Levi Apparel. But uh, yeah, we're moving to a different location. And you'll see more videos, hopefully.